This is Kaylin Bailey with your news in 90. Florida firefighters have fought for a cancer bill for years. The bill would presume that certain types of cancer be considered work-related for medical care. A key House committee approved the bill yesterday morning. Firefighters celebrated the victory, knowing the House Speaker has now relented on his objections over the cost. The bill passed unanimously, and the room erupted into cheers. For years now, firefighters have claimed the fumes they constantly inhale in their line of work is directly related to these cancers. Tens of millions of dollars worth of drugs were delivered by the Coast Guard to the Everglades. The Coast Guard hauled more than 14,000 pounds of marijuana and 3,600 pounds of cocaine into the Port Everglades on Thursday. The drugs were seized from drug smugglers off the coast of Mexico, Central America and South America. The estimated cost of all the drugs is $62 million. The massive fire that destroyed much of Notre Dame surprisingly did not harm bees that lived in the cathedral's rooftop. Some 180,000 bees clung to life as the fire raged on, experts saying their main goal was to protect their queen. Carbon dioxide from the smoke did not kill the bees, but instead put them in a drunk state and made them fall asleep. Officials were happy to realize that multiple beehives were unscathed after the fire was put out. The beehives were installed a few years ago as a Paris-wide effort to save the bees. That's your News in 90, but your Florida news is always on at WUFT.org.